Hello and welcome. We are going to show you about trapdoors. Now, just before we begin, um, I am going to show you the craftable trapdoor, but if you've come across this video, there's a possibility that when you were searching for a trapdoor, you meant like a piston trapdoor. So just to, in, ca in case that happened to be a reason you came by, I am going to show that as well. So let's go on and start first with showing how a trapdoor is actually crafted. It is done by any of the woods, any of the plank woods that is. I'll show you what each one looks like. And also by iron. So for the woods, it is simply placed like this and you can make all the different trap doors. I can place them on the ground so you can see them. Oops. I'm in creative, by the way, just so this video is shorter. But you know, you can go find these woods. Let's see, we have oak, spruce, which is my favorite. I love spruce. Birch, jungle, acacia, and dark oak. And I really like dark oak as well. But you know, they're all really cool trap doors. Now, iron is a little bit different. Instead of six, it's only four. Here's an iron trap door, which cannot be opened by hand manually. You have to have some sort of activation, like a redstone or a button or something. And there you have it. So that's how you make trap doors. But of course, like I said, there's a possibility that you are searching for like something like a piston trap door. So let's go ahead and show you that while you're here. Now I like stone a lot for a trap dome, a trap door sort of trap area. So. Let's get, of course, some sticky pistons. We're going to want redstone. Redstone torch. Redstone repeater. And stone pressure plate. And of course, some more stone. Okay. So we want a hallway of four blocks wide. One, two, three, one, one, two, three, four. Then you can place the sticky pistons right there. One, two, three, four. Boom, 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 boom. Let's just make it go by four. And that was off, wasn't it? Ho, oh, oh. ho. I didn't mean to do that. Get rid of that because I don't need it. Okay, so we have the four pistons there. Now also, behind the pistons, you want to place the four redstone. Great. Then we've got to tunnel a little bit both sides. We'll fill this back in with stone soon. We've got that there. But now, of course, we're going to want to build the pit. And you can put whatever you want in it. You know, we're probably going to do lava. The only problem with lava is it makes noise. And so, um, if you want it to be more hidden, you have to make it deeper. Because you don't want people hearing that lava. Great. Okay. Then we want to place, let's see, redstone here, and then the stone here with two stone pressure plates. That's going to be the area that people step to activate this. You can also use trip wire if you think that hides better, but I think stone to stone pressure plates work pretty well, pretty good as well. Put two there, and then of course underneath you saw that I have redstone. So we have the redstone right there. Place two blocks here with redstone torches Oop. on either side. Great. Then we can get the redstone coming up. And all you want to do is make it meet the redstone up there. Boom, boom, boom. It works. Let's do it on this side as well. Great. Yeah, see, I made it a little bit different, but it still works. Um, of course, I f didn't get the repeater like I meant to. Now you have to place a repeater in there. Tick three. Oh, maybe that's a good reason to actually have it come back one. So then I can have the repeater there. One, two, three. Great. And now we got to fill it in. So we don't want them to see this. 
You just want to make it look natural. Too even, it won't look as good, so break a block here or there. Yeah, so that makes it look more natural. You also want to make it so they can't choose the high ground. Of course, when you're making this world, you'll probably spend more time making it look better. But, you know, I don't want to waste your time here. Alright. So, people are walking by, they come down this tunnel, and they say, Oh, nice. Of course, at that angle, I can see the pressure plates. Maybe I want to make it a little higher. This works even better if you have it, like, in a, in a dark cave. When there's no lights, people are less likely to see this stuff. And they walk along, they say, This is nice. Oh, no! The trap piston door and they're stuck here and they die in the lava. And that's that. Quite simple. So yeah, this is just a tutorial about how to craft the trap door, but also just in case you came by for the piston trap door, then you know how to do it as well. Well, that's all there is to it, guys, so enjoy!